Well, hello, hello, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Miss Coffee here. And today we're back with another artist highlight. Now, this artist highlight is a little bit special to me as it is from one of my best friends from over on Twitch. His name, Brooklyn Kaiju. Now, you guys might have met Brooklyn Kaiju from a raid that we did before I started Twitch over to YouTube or over to Twitch from YouTube one Friday night and you guys fell in love with him just as much as I did and he finally opened up a print shop. Now, he doesn't have all of his prints up just yet. I'm waiting for that kaiju, but he does have some prints up and some other stuff as well and I ordered some of course and now we're going to share it on screen here. One first things first, I got to say the uh, Death Stranding tape, nice touch. <laughs> so there's a game called Death Stranding that Mr. Coffee loves. And this is, I, I believe this is where the tape is from. Now uh, I'm hiding, of course, my address because you don't need to know where I live. And look, look at that. Look at that. Look at, somebody come and look at this. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and get into this. I hope everyone's having a wonderful, wonderful day. And I ordered stuff for the family and I, and I wanted to be his first customer. So I ended up Placing the first order, but giving it to the wrong address. Ooh, I love the black uh, tissue paper. Let's go. All nicely wrapped, and I just like clawed at it with my nail. <laughs> the the nuggy knives. So we're gonna go ahead. And we're just gonna get into it. So I, like I said, I did order a few things for the family as well because uh, if you're over on Twitch, you would have seen that he sent me one of these beanies as a gift. So the first thing we have is this very beautiful, very soft and warm merino wool beanie that he sells over in his shop. And of course, I will have Brooklyn Kaiju's socials down in the description box of this video if you want to give him a follow on Instagram or Twitter or Twitch, or if you just want to go check out his shop. So beautiful, beautiful. Oh, look, it's a mouth magnet. Ah! So while ago, long while ago, back when we first met Kaiju from YouTube, uh, he made these milk magnets and he included them in the order. So it is a magnet and it says milk. And if you're over on Twitch, this is actually one of his emotes because it was, it's, it was a, a thing that they had going on. Apparently he says milk like this because he's from New York, of course. And so he made it into a magnet. So it's milk. <laughs> <laughs> and then of course i already have my sticker on my store my sketchboard but the brooklyn kaiju logo sticker and it's clear and i'm going to put that back in there because i think the kids each got one and then of course mr coffee as well so there's that one and there's that one so they each got a sticker and a magnet let's go then something else he also or offers on his shop are these pens of his logo. Brooklyn loves his logo and you will see it everywhere. So he included pens of his logo. They're nice big pens. As you can see, I have bare paws and it fits in the palm of my hand. It's a decent size. It Look at, look how shiny it is. The way I get distracted by shiny things. <laughs> so we have it in white, Twitch exclusive purple and black. And of course, I had to get all of them because Mr. Coffee will like the black one. I like the white one. And then the purple one, I'll probably figure out something. That'll probably go on my beanie, honestly, because uh, that way nobody's fighting over it. So there's that. Plus, I don't want to give the kids anything that they can stab each other with. They got enough problems. So those are the pins. And now we're going to move on to the prints. Now, each print is printed on like super duper fancy paper. You get a certificate of authenticity because the prints are going to be limited edition, meaning he's only going to sell a hundred of each print before he takes it down and adds a new print. So the first one, Pigeon Boy, let's go. This is another one of his emotes. When I first met Kaiju, I believe he was working on this piece on his stream and I've been begging him forever to make this a print. He said he was going to have a print shop opening and I waited and waited and waited and waited and he finally opened up the print shop and it was one of the first items I had in my cart. So I'm not going to take the cardboard out because as you can see again the logo, the logo, eh, eh, the little logo porn going on over here. But all of his prints will come in one size. I believe they're all coming in the same size because this is the same size as the first one I got which I'll show you. So this is Pigeon Boy. And if you live in New York, you know. <laughs> <laughs> but 
but this is a cute little character of a pigeon boy that he drew and like I said this was one of the first illustrations I seen him draw on his stream when I met him and so I, of course it has sentimental value which means it had to come home with me so there is pigeon boy and of course we have a signature down at the bottom and it's embossed so you can see the embossing down there at the bottom as well with his logo but the quality of this print, you guys, and the hell he went through to get it. I tell y'all what, his printer broke and everything when he launched his shop and he was still able to get these out in a reasonable amount of time. So I thank him for that. So we have Pigeon Boy. I'm just gonna put this off to the side. Mr. Coffee's gonna be so happy when he gets home. <laughs> that one's actually going up in the living room with Mr. Coffee, if you guys don't remember. Mr. Coffee is from New York. And so he always talks about the pigeons of New York. And so I purposely also got that print for him so he can hang it up in the living room. Oh, sorry. The next one with this certificate, Sunny with a Chance of Sadness. Again, another 12 by 12. And we're just going to pull it out of the sleeve here, just real quick. Sunny with a chance of sadness. Look how vibrant those colors are. He has a very kawaii style to his art, and we love to see it. Look at the little raindrop. <laughs> the raindrop is sun tanning, and you can see it evaporating right there. You see the water droplets? How cute is this piece? And there's like a little Easter egg in this piece, which is right there. So with this piece, technically you're getting two pieces because this is another piece that he made. Um, I'm not, I, I believe he does have it up in the shop now, but this is another piece that he made that is up in his shop. But you get it in this particular picture and look at the pattern on the curtains. You guys, this is also another one of his emotes. It's just her head though. It's not like the whole thing. And of course it's embossed at the bottom there with his signature. Isn't it gorgeous? Oh my God, I love the colors. I love, love, love the colors. Kaiju, thank you so much for these beautiful prints. Oh my goodness. And then the last one here that I'm, well, it's not the last one I'm gonna show you, but this one here is Head in the Clouds. Now, this one has significant meaning because uh, you'll see, I'll show you. <laughs> I'll show you the significance of this piece. And you tell me what you think when you see it, okay? Now, when he made this piece, he knows what my children look like, but not enough to like, you know, draw them. So he thought. Y'all, again, head in the clouds. Tell me this isn't Orion. Again, we have the embossment at the bottom there. Tell me this isn't Orion. I, I, oh my God, those eyes big curly afro this piece is going to orion's room so each there there's a print for each of us and so this one of course will be going to orion's room look at the blues he's a big fan of texture <laughs> he loves this texture so his pieces are usually lineless with a lot of texture in them it's just the texture of the hair for me that i love on this because uh, literally it's my son's hair texture same colored like eyes and at the time that he made this piece Orion was missing this exact same tooth which is what made it so funny <laughs> so of course I of course begged him to make this one a print too because I really wanted to get it for Orion and Orion even saw it and was like is he drawing me he had no idea that he was making a piece that looked like my son so uh yeah of course I had to get it and we love to see it. Now there is one more piece that is not available in his shop that he sent to me as a gift, okay? Um, so let me grab it real quick. It's this one here. Now this one here will always be special to me. It will always stay in prim primo condition. It will never have hands touch it until it's put into its frame. And this will probably be the last time it comes out of this packaging until I get a frame to put it up on the wall. I literally have a wall dedicated to this art print, okay? This one's called World Peace. Now, Kaiju, when I first met him, he, he of course, is a digital artist over on Twitch. So you can watch him as he creates these beautiful masterpieces that he does. This particular piece, there is something about it that makes me happy stem. So if you are neurodivergent, you know what happy stem is. If you don't, 
essentially it creates a tingling sensation in the body and you start shaking your hands or your feet. And for some reason, this piece, just there's something about it that I just love so much. And I started bugging him to get it. He refused to sell it to me, no matter how much I begged and no matter how much I offered him, he refused to sell it to me. So when he sent me the surprise package, he sent it to me to let me know that he appreciated all my support and to let me know that this piece will never be sold as it is only a piece that he gives out to his friends. I am honored to be able to be one of those lucky few people that he considers a friend. And so what is the piece? It's actually the screensaver on his tablet. So you don't see it too often. And again, it's embossed with his signature. You don't see it too often. And I don't know what it is about this piece that makes me so happy, but I love, I could stare at this all day. And when I first saw it as his screensaver, I asked him about it and I kept asking him and kept asking him. And finally he, he let me get it by sending, to, sending it to me as a thank you. So Kaiju to you, for those folks who don't know, Kaiju is the reason why I'm over on Twitch. He was the one that was encouraging me to show my art and not be afraid to be on the journey and the spot in my journey that I'm on with my art. So to you, Kaiju, thank you so, so much. I wish you the best with your shop and everything else. And if you would like to order something from his shop, brooklynkaiju.com. And of course, I will have it linked in the description box of the video. It will be the very first link so you guys can go over and check out his art prints. As of the day that I'm making this video, there is also a coupon for a couple of the prints on his site. So please go over and check it out. So I greatly, greatly appreciate it to anyone who does. Kaiju, thank you so much for all the encouragement and support and helping me to make a whole new group of friends that I can now call my newest coffee beans. I love you and I again I wish you the best with your shop and everything that you do. So Brooklyn Kaiju ladies and gentlemen. Now with that said I'm done. That's that's what I got. I've been waiting for these prints. I feel like my whole life okay. Um, so yeah so we have head in the clouds. Cloudy with a chance of sadness and Pigeon Boy, Lego, Lego. And on top of the prints, we also have the three pins, the Twitch exclusive purple, the black pin and the white pin. We also have the Merino wool beanie. And of course, each one of these will come with a magnet and a sticker. So there you have it. Our artist highlight of Brooklyn Kaiju. Again, to check him out, look down in the description box of this video for all of his links. And with that said, I must now bid you adieu. But not before reminding you that it's hard out here in these crafty streets. Please stay safe. Wear a mask. Wash your hands. Don't touch your face in public because that's gross. Keep your six feet and always try to remember to be kind to others. You never know what somebody else is going through. Be courteous because it's the right thing to do. And always stay cool. Bye, guys.